Hello everyone. Um, I'm doing a, I have my photos in hand and I'm doing page, page kits for them. And um, with this one here, I'm going to be, I'd rather be crafting by Lori Whitlock and it's a Echo Park. And I'm going to be using uh, page maps with it. And I'm going to be using this one right here with the, well, I'm actually going to use the B on it too. So I'm going to have um, at least two pictures and then something here. And I don't know if my title is going right there, but we'll, we'll see how it turns out. And so I've got these two pictures of, she's the youngest granddaughter. And this is Skylar. And I think I was um, eating cookies. There's not supposed to be cookies in the scrapbook area. <laughs> but she was learning how to cut and she was very good at it. And she just turned six yesterday. So I'm going to be doing those pictures. And I've already matted them in this. Because that's want to use that dark around there. She's sitting in this chair that I, I painted it pink because I've had some have so many granddaughters so she always whenever she comes to visit she goes where's my pink chair <laughs> and then um, I'll probably use this maybe this maybe this <laughs> and um, so we'll see about that some of those cards I am going to use this paper because there wasn't too many things that actually had scissors on them so I'm going to be using that and I'll be matting it in this and I'll probably gut it and then cut some flowers out uh, on there from there. And then I have these elementary scissors that I've spray painted white and I'm going to use that on the layout too. So that will be so fun. And so that's ready to go with its sketch. And then I've got Jen Hadfield again, that one I just actually used. And I'm going to be doing Tegan again with it. She likes the neutrals, so I kind of been using it for her. Well, this will be the second one I do for her. And um, I'll mat it in this. I'm going to um, have a mat around it because you know how I love that. And I might gut it and maybe mat her photo again. I've already just got it matted in white. And I'm going to be using some scraps that I had. Oh, I kind of beat that up. So I've got this um, one cut out with uh, Martha Stewart um, punch. Like the, it's like a wide lace. And then I'm going to be using some branding strips and a piece of rose gold glitter. Um, and then a bunch of more brand, bunch of more. That's, that's what it is, a bunch of more. <laughs> I think that's Italian for a bunch. <laughs> and then a little scrap. And But it, you see they all got holes in the middle. So I will be putting her in the middle so it will cover them up. Because I'm going to be using them here. And, um, and I also have a doily that I got in the Love RTS swap. And I love it. And it's um, it's inked or watercolored in um, pink that looks perfect with this. And then I've got this, and I'm going to be using um, these letters. I got them at Tuesday morning. They're a pink glitter, and I'm pretty sure they were um, thickers. And but I don't know if they're from a specific collection. And then um, I'm, I'll, I'll probably be using some of these again. And um, and I've also been carrying these little simple stories along with this line. And I guess I brought the Auburn Lane in and the My Mind's Eye Splendor. And then I also have um, these from the Peaceful Heart. I will probably be cutting some of the fussy cutting those for it too. 
So that's kind of what I got for that one. So I'm excited to get to work on that. I really love working with the scraps. And it's fun to see just how it goes. Okay, and then my next one, I am doing my grandson. He was dressed up like the Green Army Man for Halloween the year before last, 2020. And so um, I've got the Echo Park. Well, I guess it was probably Cartabella. But I picked it up at Tuesday morning, and um, it was the, it said Echo Park now, but it's by Stephen Duncan, and I'll be using this, and um, anything that has, you know, the little green army man on it, and I've got some um, corner um, photo corners with green on it, so I'll probably use those. And then I've taken some stuff off this sheet already and just kind of put them with it already. And then um, also the stickers, and I've already got them pulled off and on wax paper. So that's very fun. But um, I was going to use this. Where is it? I was going to use this, but it is like so busy, and then with all the pictures I have of him, because they were just so cute, I just kept printing all of them, and so um, I'll save this for something else. I'm sure we'll have more army men time, so that's what I have for that, and let me put that with it, and then, oh, so I'm using... Um, I don't know if this I've probably gotten a paper pad from oh let's see maybe from Joann's or something but I'm going to be using this because he is in the fall leaves but I'll probably be putting it on here because it's just so busy it's hard to see it otherwise and then this will be somehow used in my background and so that's for that one whoops I got a keep this with it okay and then one of my very faves this is my husband him and Aiden were playing army men and so I am going to use that I've already um, matted them I'm gonna use it on this wood and put it on here and then I'm gonna be using a, some of this paper too, the stars and Let's see, what else did I have for this? Oh, um, I'll be right back. Uh, this is the best part, couldn't forget these. I bought these brads, I think they were from um, Scrapbook Generations, but they are the little green army guys. And there's six different patterns. I don't know if you can see them really good, let me find something to lay them on. Like this guy, he looks like he's waving him in. And here's a guy with the bazooka. Oh, maybe there's three patterns, I guess. And here's one with a gun. So they're they're really cute. So I'm gonna use those on here. And then um, I've got these black letters I'm gonna use with that. And some of them will have to be MacGyvered. <laughs> <laughs> so that's my um, page kits for well I'll actually probably start it maybe one this week but um, I really can't wait to do this one so maybe I'll do that tomorrow but that's what I plan on working with and um, thank you for watching remember to give it a like if you like it and subscribe if you had not thanks for joining me bye bye